Hey folks, welcome back to my channel. I have two very special guitars in comparison for you today. One is a Lakewood, that's the one I'm holding on my lap. A Lakewood from the custom shop, um, an M14 with a mahogany top from 2003. And the one I'm showing you in a minute is a Taylor X-Braced um, 324. SEB with shaded edge bursts, but both have uh, mahogany or sapelli back and sides and a mahogany top. And what that does is a mahogany is typically has not the brightest range of, of um, sounds if you want, but um, it's a little sits a little bit more in the middle. And when you have a mahogany topped guitar, um, it even takes that character further. So you you get a little bit of compression and um, a very fundamental heavy sound and um, it has a certain sweetness to it especially if you play a, a mahogany top guitar from a brand that's normally more on the brighter modern sound um, spectrum um, the mahogany top rounds off the edges on both sides um, and gives it a certain sweetness. Um, my tip is, my trick is to play a bit nearer to the um, to the bridge and uh, to give it a little bit more sparkle. Um, I'm playing with a blue chip TD35, and uh, the both guitars are strung with um, Elixir. Phosphor bronze nano web lights. No, the Taylor is with elixirs, phosphor bronze nano web lights. The Lakewood is with the um, Yudario XS, also phosphor bronze lights. I don't think the strings make too much of a difference because they are very close. Lakewood is a German brand and they built this um, special guitar for um, one of their dealers in Germany for, the, for his 25th anniversary. Um, that's why the logo of Fritz Rössel guitars is here um, inlaid to the fretboard. Okay, let's start with some basic strumming. can hear the, the attack of the pig, which is very, very smooth.
needs a very, from both guitars, a very true, a very woody sound. And um, I know that you can, uh, with hard top, hard wood topped guitars, you can, you can drive them really hard. But I, I think they have a sweet spot with light strumming. And um, yeah, maybe I can do some finger picking. sustain the clarity the warmth the the overall sweetness it's hard to describe but it's very intimate um, not too loud but very quality sounding i don't know if it makes any sense um, i'm switching to a dunlop 0.73 mils and do some open chording um, yeah absolutely love them both um, both are quite similar I think um, in specs both are quite similar in size and wood timbers wood selection but I, f I feel the lakewood is a little bit more open sounding and the liquid the lake was a little bit more open sounding the tailor is a little bit more focused sounding but um, that's just from where i sit um, maybe you can hear it different you hear it different differently i hope you enjoyed this <laughs> quick comparison um, i have another mahogany top guitar um, an atkin 
OM with mahogany top. Um, maybe I can do a comparison uh, in the next weeks where I can um, compare all three of them. Till then, see you next time. Bye bye.